blew it up. We blew the. It's it's not quite, quite happened. Parts. Okay, I should have question. What? Why do you come here dressed like that but act all shy? Because I'm. She's selective to who she acts like that. No, she dresses like that. Oh, he's like, doing the count thing. You're just the lucky one that got it first tonight. <laughs> yeah, she, had, she, she didn't need the Yeah, the tomorrow night's another story. <laughs> yeah, you keep dreaming, you folks. No, I go for dreaming. Though. That's it? Say on to the cold seat. Just tell him it's time for the cold seat. Time for, it's time for cold seat, folks. Time for cold seat. It's time for cold seat, folks. I know that... David Herman. This is David Herman, the guy, it. the guy that raped. Just got, who's, who's doing sound? Okay, ready to this fucking space? What do you need? Ready? Yeah, you gotta get somebody to run the sound. Hey, bro, oh, roll, roll it up. Suck my test. What do you got? What do you want? Hey, hey. Well, uh, just, just kind of like uh, run it, you know, like so it doesn't get too loud or something. I help the handicapped. You ready, Lewis? Ready. All right, let's do, the, let's do the intro and then. Uh, and then Ducci will get right into his, uh... Ducci, this is the beer. Here's the beer. Oh, you gotta keep, keep your, you gotta keep your beer down. No, no, keep the idiot bouncing around here. You gotta keep your beer down. Oh, I can handle the beer. Keep your beer down. Beer's cool. Beer's cool, it could be funny. Well, keep it down. Ducci cannot... I can't, yeah. no, this yeah, is for, okay. no, 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 you can't, just, you can't deal with this, dude. Like, like this. this is high potency yeah. stuff, you cannot deal with this, this is like alcohol, that is like, that, that is guys that farmers mash up and put in uh, cattle feed, you know, they give, either give it to you or they give it to cows. Okay, I don't know what they pay you ready, Lewis? the crowd to laugh at. Alright. I better pay the crowd good. Okay, so I'll do the intro. Get a little mic uh, check in your mics there. Do the mic check there, dude. Mot my crew. Did I just take two of them? Okay, get this one out of the way. Here, come on, get, get your. Ow! He's fighting for one eighth of an hour. God, man. Go ahead, go ahead, get this one out of the way. Talk in your mic, talk in your mic. And get this. Hey, about, you think about. I would lie to you, Lewis? Okay, you ready, Lewis? All right. Thank you for being with us again tonight, particularly all you people in Anchorage, Alaska. We invite you again to see El Ducci, probably the smartest man in the world, the man that knows everything. And, to, and tonight, uh, the trailer machine isn't working, so we want to just give the credits early. Uh, the production assistant, Candy O. Cameraman, Lewis, you can turn the camera on yourself. Uh, lights are by Danny, sound is done by Don Bulls and Mike, and the staff of uh, Hollywood's Instagram. We start these videos with Ducci giving a few comments on the news of today. Our man, the guy that tells us everything, take notes, get your, uh, pad, get your steno pads out. All you people at home, get your steno pads out, sharpen those pencils, and this is what we're going to do this week. El Ducci! Yo! Yeah, El Ducci! Ah! Woo! I'll tell you about terrorism. The Navy whipped out. The Navy whipped out. Pugs. You know what it is. If I was boss man, see what I do is I I I'd hire some bikers at low cost. And I'd say some sissy bitch is squealing. Only uh Tired turkey is gonna start squawking, and then you hide back in the bushes. You say, squawking turkey. Usually they have a red covering, red covering or, or tattoos. No, the bitch has tattoos or a red covering. Or a mouthful of lies. You say, shoot the bitch. Shoot that turkey down. 
shoot that third game. Sometimes they may put on a show and a mouthful of lies. We're going to pay him 25 bucks and we're going to solve this fucking problem. Right there. That's All it. right. And the whole... You'll whole... be in charge of it. No, no, he's not, he's not in charge of it. You'll be in charge of it. Okay, go You're going to be in charge of it. That's his sales pitch. All right, you got it? This is fine. His wife does know that I fucked her. Made her squeal like a pig. But... It doesn't matter. Terrorism. On airplanes. I robbed this 747. Who cares? It doesn't matter to me either. Baby. You could sit there and smooch your boyfriend who's a piece of shit. You're just rambling again. You're swearing. You gotta, like, go with the script. Say the one fucking line, we'll move on. I know, but he's just... You know what it is? Is he's paid more than I am. What? The gas list? He's got a couple good things to say. Where's the gas list? Okay, no, 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 balance in the book. No, no, okay. Well, oh, yeah. Welfare. Welfare. I'll tell you about welfare. There's these scam operators. They come in Canadian style. And they lie so much that they come with, with tattoos. The biggest scam operators have tattoos and long purple hair. I'll tell you what. Fuck the world. I'll tell you what. Paranoia from the crowd tells me when I mention the word, there he is. I hear him crying. <laughs> Red dog. Did you fuck her? Did you violate her? Can I lie to her? Go ahead. This is your best line you pull up. Don't call a script. John Brad. No wonder nobody wants to say that. You gotta say deep in the lab. Live aid take care of it. Okay, okay, it's time to get in the live aids. Live aids. Okay, we, we've dealt with Red Dog. His, his horribleness. Who cares? We got Mike Brennan. Okay, our first guest tonight, Donnie, appeared in a Rolling Stone. Didn't appear, but they wrote about you. It's like you were the instigator. You were like telling this guy, go see that girl, this girl, go see that guy. Is that right? We're going to find all about it in just a moment. Stay tuned. Yeah. Donnie stuck the microphone up his butt. And get this. Some horny chick. Shocker. And the false collapse is a total failure. No. Move this thing along, man. It's too slow. Wait, wait, wait. So they're like fucking. Douchey, not a fucking goddamn thinger, man. Pay him a goddamn thinger. Hey, you no know one gave me the money to say this bullshit. <laughs> Can you ask me shit about what call I Doug, did? Call Doug Moody and ask him for your money. Doug Moody. <laughs> All right. Okay, douche. Now, come on, ask me some questions, man. Fuck. What do you, yeah, I know I Fuck did. It. I like that big old so fat what? ass beaver I on your drum. My wife. I like that big old fat ass beaver on your drums. Are you this a little bit? Hey, no, I'm in my whiskey, I'll do you. Are you in my fucking goddamn gym? Oh, I want to hear you cry. You're drunk enough. Give me that back. Come on. Give me that. You're a fucking. God. 
Calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. That's drinking my gin, man. You gotta look at it. You got, got your ass enough fairy. You're jerking me for a chain. How can we get? Jinchi just asked me to ask you that, like, uh, why in the Rolling Stone they say you're like a professional gossip and you just run around and say bad things about this guy and that girl, run from one club to another. I don't know anything about Rolling Stone saying professional gossip, talk bad things. I don't talk bad things about people all over everybody. Yeah, I've got all pals that are around here. Mm. Got a whole lot of pals around here, man. I, don't like, I keep my nose at everybody else's business, too. Uh -huh. These fucking bears do you jump shit all around. Yeah, you know that, boy? Come on, man, it's feeling some beer here, boy. Get your ass up there and start talking some shit, man. Should we throw them off? Yeah. This time off the concert. Hey, douchey. <laughs> this is a security guard in the audience. When's, the, when's your last time your weenie was in a good thing? Throw them off. I, I, throw them off? When's the last off. time your weenie was in a good thing, off. man? Off. When's the last time you had fine feminine lips around your weenie? <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> He ain't gonna give me no shit. Come on here, man. I'd give you shit, but you're already sitting on it and your face is full of it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's your problem, man. Maybe. Hey, douche. Hey, hey douche. How, how about how about a comment? Oh, but fuck you. How about a comment no slut no we swearing. had there a while? Take turns on us and everything, no man. No swearing. No swearing. No swearing. Mm. I'm gonna have to have rectal sex. <laughs> you know, some new type of Vaseline coming out today is just that. It doesn't like, matter. You're gonna have to beat me with the strip. Beat you with the what? <laughs> Talk about your chicks. <laughs> Did y'all fix your goddamn sign here, boy? You fucking. Your fucking sign fell down, man. It's the your sign fell down, boy. All right, now come on, douche. Most chickens squawk. I I've never heard one giggle. Giggle? How about scream? How about moan? How about? Do you like the girls moan in your ears and drip and slick your ear and shit? No, while you're I like to hear the sound of the last squaggle. Last squaggle, you just. This guy's trying to take over your show. In other words, you want to take over my show? I don't want to do that, douche. You gotta start. He's, start. he's doing all the talking. He's asking the questions. I think you better just. I think somebody's trying to take over my show. Obviously, uh, a little off tonight. <laughs> Donnie doesn't understand discipline. Donnie, what is it like when you got a dig of your butt? When I got a what? A you dig. Quit talking dirty, man. That never happened to me, douchey man. Oh, man, I've never been electrocuted myself either. <laughs> Sin, death, run, I or fruit. Yeah. What? Hey, uh, Lou, you want to get another angle maybe now? Okay. Hey, douchey. Douchey. <laughs> Tex, why don't you come up and just like say something? We'll just plug it in. Louis, Louis. You, you can interview him. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, great. Look at that. Balance. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't believe all the bad things you've been saying about my good friend here, Mr. Al Newton. Now, I think you will find him a very reputable gentleman. Look at him. He's so peaceful. Now, this guy never said a bad thing about anybody. He's minding his own business, trying to be cool, you know. 
Grab a few Z's. Ah. <laughs> and, you know, I heard he takes his grandma to church on Sundays. And, and he really, he's a good person and stuff. And y'all, I don't be going around saying bad things about him. Because he's liable to put you in the cornfield. <laughs> well, <clears throat> you know, originally I wasn't going to do this show tonight, you know. I said, no, I cannot be on a show with so much tension and uh, regression and anarchic thinking and stuff. I mean, anarchic. I mean, uh, hello, Anchorage, Alaska. I mean, uh, Anchorage, Alaska, Alaska. Anyway, and my boss told me, he said, I'll give you two free Budweiser's if you go on this show, text Cal. And I said, well, boss, you got a deal. <coughs> And I said, anyway, somebody's got to speak up for this guy, you know? Everybody goes around saying such mean things, and it just is not true. Look at this angel. Look at it. Isn't that nice? Ladies and gentlemen, I tell you, he sings like a bird. And this is like a butterfly. Here, encore, encore. This is wonderful, wonderful. Isn't it beautiful, ladies and gentlemen? And you know something? He's even smarter than that. Why? You know what? He used to be a multimillionaire. That's what he told me one night. He goes, you know what? Everybody just thinks I'm just a lead singer of a band called The Mentors, but boy, do they got me wrong. <laughs> I used to be a multi-millionaire, and I sold cars, and I, I was a real Hollywood, California, United States of America, and, and here he is, the American dream, having a nightmare. Ow! <laughs> Ooh-wee, that, that guy's scary, I'll tell you. But, hmm, but, um, you know, well, I feel like I'm hogging the show and everything, you know, and, so, I want Abdul to say a few more things for y'all, okay? Before I go away in the dreamland. Mm. <laughs> and all little birdies in the bush? <laughs> that looks like a old bush on his chin, don't it, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> And, and look at he's got his own ice machine. <laughs> and oh boy, I'll tell you, is this what he's been drinking? I'll tell you, to make somebody go to sleep so quick. Well, ah, I'm running out of things. Tax, you go on a long tour for 65 days, Don. You play in all the United States. You go all over everywhere in the United States, you playing some real good things, and they're gonna come back and you're gonna be real rich. You gonna still love me? Well, I plan to save at least 50 bucks on this tour, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, thank you very much for joining us now, bitch, and wonderful, beautiful, glamorous hockey in California, home of California, United States of America, and come back next week. And we'll be having more words of the wise. <laughs> From Mr. Abishai himself. Isn't it wonderful, I know? It's a wonderful thing what this man is doing here. Uh, I'll go beyond senior on steel because there ain't nobody like him. And oh, another thing, I do get, I was not invited to the AIDS concert <laughs> uh, because I've not been bitten and by enough mosquitoes, but I would like to donate this bottle of beer touched authentically by the lips of El Vice. Send us them hungry people. Come, Vince. Val Vice, thank you very much. And bye. He said bye, Cunis. I'm in a cute way. <laughs>